friends, it's Nico. I got two packages in today, so I'm just gonna do one of these right now. I just woke up from like a four hour nap. Apparently, Zentara was starving and she needed her food. So, I got it. I had a Spirit of Christmas Bazaar that um, Laura from Peek and Boo's Creations and her husband Mark and I, as Elvin Spun, did. I have Christmassy pretties on. This is a Christmas color um, chainmail weave bracelet from Lexi of Phoenix Fine Design. This is a snowflake ornament that I made into a necklace charm for me. And these are some awesome freaking Christmas tree earrings from Giddis Creations. So I wore, I wore lots of handmade stuff today. I also had my ears on. I took them off before I fell asleep. I'm exhausted. I'm still exhausted. Um, yes. <laughs> I totally forgot to wear my bracelet that I had, that Mark gave me at our very first convention four years ago now. So that didn't even make it onto my wrist. I forgot until I fell asleep. So I got two things. This one is the Target Beauty Box unboxing. Dun 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 dun. Still doesn't have great lighting because I have to pick up light bulbs for that light. I don't have any light bulbs in the house. Apparently we used them. So, ooh, it says time sensitive material on the back. It's the first time I've ever had that. So, the Target Beauty Box. I'm very excited. There are two boxes this month. This is the ladies box and there is a boy box, a uh, guys box. I always call it the boy box because it just sounds cute. I thought about getting it for my husband, but he just got, okay, he stole my Dollar Shave executive box that I was going to share with him. He stole the entire thing. He loves it. It's, it's totally worth it. So I'll just get my own Dollar Shave Club box. This is the Target Beauty box. It was $7. It is their holiday one, their December box. I don't even have the cellophane off, so we're just gonna, we're gonna get inventive and use my packing tape because like a whole whole bag full of this stuff. Gazoom, squeeze sneezing. Gazoom tight. You okay? Can you keep talking? All right, we're gonna try to use this and open it because I am so tired. I don't even wanna go look for any scissors. But I really, really, I, I can't wait to unbox this stuff. Like, I can't have it waiting a couple of days because it'll drive me nuts. I have to open it the day I get it. And since Zentara insisted for the last 45 minutes I get up and feed her because she's starving, um, I figured, there we go. It's just this I figured I'll do the unboxings because I... I look half awful. I'm pretty tired. Uh, the lighting is not good. And I fell asleep with my, my makeup on, so it's kind of faded, but it doesn't matter. So, Target Beauty Box. Let's do this. The boxes always have a smell from whatever is in them. It is a gold card, ombre gold, and red tissue paper. And it says, Hello Holidays. The rush is here. Inside the box, you'll find a few of our beauty faves that'll keep you calm, cool, and collected all season long. Try them out, and if you love them as much as we do, go to Target, 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 and go buy it. And the cheat sheet's on the back, not looking at that, but as always, it's that $3 off coupon. We order of like $15 or more on beauty stuff, and skincare, and cosmetics, and hair care, so there is that. Let us open, ooh, ooh, oh, oh, dang, okay, okay, just, just looking at it, holy crap, that's, that's a lot of stuff, more than I expected, um, hmm, we're gonna go with the one thing I know I'm not gonna use, I know it, I'm not a bad person, but I have my own nails, oh yeah, my nail polish is from Turtle Tootsie Polish, this is a terrible photo, photo, it's a terrible look. But this is her Deadpool. This is Deadpool. This is Deadpool with the glitter topper of the Zodiac sign Cancer. 
and this is sea turtle with the topper, the glitter topper of Cancer, and that's sea turtle by itself, and that's Deadpool by itself. Yay, Christmas colors! So, this is back to Target, the Impress Press-On Manicure. These are really freaking pretty. They are, wow, they are very fancy. That is glitter and red. That is very holiday. Holy crap. And there's a coupon on the back that says save a dollar when you buy any Impress Press-On Manicure, which is a package of these. So this will be going to somebody, I don't know, I'll probably include it in a giveaway in the Elven Grove. Um, well, wow, that's really cute. I just, I don't use, I don't use fake nails. I never have. I've always either bitten my nails to hell. When I was growing up, I used to have all of my nails that short because I would bite them. That one broke from working. But I always had short, bitten nails. And then when I was in high school, I wanted to go to the military ball because I was in ROTC and I grew them out. These are still shorter than they usually are. And these are definitely kept shorter because they break while I work. Anyway, back to the box. <laughs> Sorry about that, but these are cute. I won't use them. That's the reason why I won't use them. So, bada boom. Oh, it's a perfume sample from Vera Wang. Um, it's called Embrace. It's a fruity floral fragrance. Blending dewy notes of melon with floral sea of marigold and gardenia. Along with the creaminess of soft musk. I am not a big floral person. Peoples know that. Let's just. And it's in a cute little pump bottle. Okay, that's not overtly floral. It definitely has a floral to it. Um, it smells more. It smells like. I really like this. I might have to tell my husband I found a new perfume smell. I rarely wear perfumes anyway. I have like a whole bunch of body sprays and some Victoria's Secret perfumes that he picked out. Well, I picked out the body sprays. He picked out the Victoria's Secret perfume and my little sister gave me one that I loved on her. Okay, it's drying a little bit. It does have a very soft floral But the meloniness, the fruitiness, is not overtly fru fruity. It's not really sweet. It is a soft musk, like a really true soft musk. That dries down nicely. What kind of person can I picture this on? Um, I would picture this on a really well put together woman. Or I. Um that knows they're going out in public, they don't want to choke anybody, like, with a whole bunch of smells, so they, but they want, like, a little scent on them. This is really nice, and it's that kind of smell you're just like, ooh, you smell good. That, that's kind of what this is. It's not, it's not very, especially the one spritz, it is not very strong, but it is definitely there. Like, if I walked by somebody and they were wearing this, I would just be like, you smell really nice. So this is very nice. It is not a killer floral scent. That is wonderful. Next. Ooh, there's so much stuff. Okay. This looks like... Ooh, a finishing mist. Which I think is a... Another term for shampoo. Yeah, shampoo. For, um, hairspray. It's a lightweight, refreshingly fragrant. Yeah, it's fragrant. Okay. So... It is a Nexus Finishing Mist. It's actually a really pretty golden bottle. Um, it is, whatever the number is, oh, it's right up front. It's hard to see because it doesn't want to focus on the, the reflectiveness. But it is a number two medium hold. So, Finishing Mist. That's always nice. I like having little hairsprays on hand. Alright, we're going to do this because I don't know what this is. This is from Ramel London. Um, apparently, it is a clump-free eyeshadow. And you're supposed to, sh for with volume, you're supposed to shake it first. 
Okay, and it is very black because, of course, black. It's, it is an eyeshadow. This is really, really heavy. Um, it is 0.3 fluid ounces or 9 milliliters. So, but this is, this is actually really heavy. I guess whatever is in it to shake, it's supposed to break up clumps in the eyeshadow. So you have clump free. I kind of wish I had this this morning. I used my eyeshadow I got from the Target Advent Calendar, which works amazingly. It's very good. I haven't used it in years, and I'm just like, why have I not been using this? But this is really cool. I have loved the Ramil London lipsticks I've gotten so far. Okay, so it's a clump-free clump volumizing mascara. Mascara. Can't talk. And this has a little target on it. It is called House Red, so it might be Target's custom color. I had It's a total hydration chapstick. Don't know what flavor it is. It's a moisture plus tint. So I guess this is the Target special because Target is on it. Um, I have the blood orange one of these and oh my god, it's amazing. I'm going to use this. I'm not going to give this away. I'm such a bad person. We're just, since it's a face video, we're just going to see. Ooh, ooh, you can see the red color. Not very well, but you can definitely see it because it's like a little pee pee hole. Oh, it's definitely a bit of a red. Oh. Alright. <clears throat> it's very moisturizing. This is definitely more than just a hint of color. It is a, like, a light lipstick. That's really nice. I like that. I think it's just the original, um, chapstick. It's not flavored. It feels really good on my lips. So, there is that. Very excited about that. Wish I had it this morning. I could just put that on for some color. Um, this is a coconut oil hair mask. N er, nourishing deep conditioner. Hask. I guess Hask is short for hair mask. I don't know unless that's the brand. Love coconut oil. Um, it's for hydrating and revitalization. I mentioned previously I don't really use hair masks, so I may I may give this to somebody. I might I might I might try it. So yeah, this honestly this hair is me waking up after like a three and a half hour nap. Oh, what's in my earring? There we go. But it doesn't look even terrible. I didn't even bother brushing it out. I'm just like, I need to do this and then I'm going back to sleep. So Hair mask. Oh, this has a pearl. This is My Beauty Diary Black Pearl Mask. I think it is a Korean mask from the writing on it. This actually looks really interesting. What is it for? It's ultra hydrating and intense brightening. Ooh. There's French written on the back and English. Oh, it's product of Taiwan, so... Taiwanese face mask. That is pretty awesome. That's the last item in the box. So, let's just recap this. Cute little box. Uh, a hair mask and a face mask. And it's probably, it's just gonna fall. Mascara. A perfume sample. Some press on nail manicure. Wow, it's like an entire ho holiday set. Like a whole holiday set of you do a little look with this. Hairspray. And some awesome tinted lipstick that I'm gonna have to get other shades of. That is the Target Beauty Box. Stuff's gonna fall. See, I'm just so tired. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, my L flames. So that's what was in the Target beauty box. Like I said, I didn't get the guy box. Kevin really didn't want it. Usually I order it without asking him, but since it had a lot of shaving products in it, I did not get it for him. Since he just got his new razor, he's just like, well, I don't need it. So I was like, okay, no problem. 
Target beauty box. That's what was in it. I love you guys. And now I'm going to go make another video with my AOA Miss A haul. That's going to be next. And yeah, I'm not doing it in the same video because that's just, it's already 15 minutes long. So I love you guys. Have fun. Be safe. Bye. Mwah.